face the facts, nobody is going to offer you a job. Please don't be so discouraged, darling. One left. I mean, this could be the one. Keep your fingers crossed. You never know. There you are. What did I tell you? Wonderful. Our problems are over. There's a giant carpet sale tomorrow at Hornchurch. Let's go to Hornchurch and buy a giant carpet. Thank you. I've been extremely patient through very difficult circumstances, but my patience is now exhausted. If you don't get a job by the end of the week, I'm going out to work. <laughs> I'm looking for. A, oh, sorry. I'm looking for. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh good morning. I'm, I'm looking. I'm looking for a job. Name? Uh, Perrin. Yes. I spent most of my life in middle management, but for the last twenty years, I've been. Uh, Christian name. Uh, I've been uh, Reginald Alanthe. I've been with Sunshine Desserts, the instant pudding people. And now I'm looking for something a little... Address. Uh, looking for... Look at 12 Coleridge clothes. Looking for something a little more stimulating and fulfilling. Age. Yes. Uh, something a little more vibrant <laughs> and exciting. Uh, age. Age, yes, age, age. yes. Oh, yes, as to age, yes. I'm uh, uh, not quite... Uh, um, uh, that's approximately... I uh, know they're 47. Um, <laughs> I want a Monday to Friday job, and if, if, if a company car was thrown in that, of course, it would be very nice. And I, I was thinking in terms of something local. I don't uh, want to commute anymore. Yes. What? Qualifications. Oh, yes, yes, the, yeah. um, uh, the, the, the uh, uh, yes, the, uh, the, um, the, 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 the Nutley Park the Court, Park. under 16 prize for woodwork, <laughs> and the, uh, the first aid certificate from the Scouts, uh, that's the West Ealing, well, uh, when I say vibrant and exciting, it doesn't have to be all that vibrant and exciting. Why did you leave Sunshine Desserts? Uh, I was sacked. <laughs> no, no, say, I, I don't want to commute. I'm prepared to travel a small distance, of course. Why were you sacked? Well, I, I sort of staged a fake suicide and, and came back. Uh, <laughs> the guy says, my long-lost friend, from the, the company car isn't absolutely essential and I'm prepared to work at big ends. What other jobs have you done? Uh, yes, I've been connected with pig farming. Oh. In, a, in, a, in, a, in a swilling out pigs connection. <laughs> and, um, <coughs> Now, when I say local, I'm prepared to travel 10 miles, 20 miles. <laughs> well, I'm afraid I see I haven't been on the blur just lately. 30 miles, 40 miles, as long as it isn't abroad. Well, we're not very far abroad. <laughs> and the managing director's job at Shell Mex was snapped up rather quickly. If anything crops up in Australia, I am prepared to consider it. <laughs> <laughs> Mr Pelham is the, is, the, is the owner of the, of the pig factory. I'll be back this afternoon at 2.30. If you can get him, Klimthorpe 7532. I can just get the 11.15 train. Excuse me. Yeah.